Hey guys, it's Sherelle here from Sunny Ray and Creations, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to do a knockout text or a offset text in Silhouette software. I already have two other videos on this type of um, text. I have one where I show you how to do it on the Cricut software, and I also have one where I show you how to do it from your phone on the Fonto software. And today we're going to be doing it on the Silhouette software. I just started working with this software. And it's pretty cool. I could do a lot of stuff. And I do have the business business edition. It is $100, but you can get it on holidays for cheaper. I only paid $49 for mine, which was a steal. And you can also sometimes get it in the bundle when you buy a silhouette machine. You can get it for free sometimes. But yeah, basically, I'm going to be showing you guys how to do this type of text. When you layer two texts on top of each other, and then you have like a blank space between both the texts so you can see the middle text better so for that we're gonna delete this we don't need it anymore so we're gonna delete all of that and we're gonna come here and we're gonna make a new text oh my my mat is also set by 12 by 12 if you don't know how to change your size mat you come up here right here to the paper thing and you could change your media size here to whatever size you want i use 12 by 12 because that's the basic size of most vinyls is 12 inches wide so once we have that we're going to come here and we're going to do a text and i'm going to write the word mom this is a very popular um style people have been doing with the word mom and the people's names in it so we're going to select this and then we're going to change the color to black so come right up here and do black and then we're going to make this bigger so we could see it And then you can leave it at this font or you could change it. I like the times font. So we're going to times like that. So boom, we have that. And I just changed the font up here. You come here, you could browse. And with the silhouette software, it shows you what it looks like. Or you could just type it in if you know what it's called. So I just typed in times and it changed it for me. Now we're going to do the names. Um, I'm going to actually show you real quick. I'm going to input it real quick and then come back and show you guys. Give me one second. Okay, so this is the font I'm using. It is called I Love Glitter. And we're going to be doing this name right here. We're doing Sarah and Elliot. And I'm going to show you how to do this in a regular font first. Just so you guys can see the symbols I use. So you guys know how to get the open hearts and the closed solid hearts right here. So we're gonna go to text here. And for the open hearts, you're gonna do the underscore. So we're gonna hit shift and the score button next to the zero on your keyboard and it'll be the underscore. And then you're gonna type the name in. And then for the solid heart in the middle, we're hitting the straight line button. It's right under, I have a MacBook Pro, but it's right under my delete button. And then we're gonna hit, type in the other name, and then we're gonna go back and do underscore. So this is how your name is gonna look before we transform it into the I Love Glitter font. So you're gonna come here, change the color you want. We could do a nice purple. And then you're gonna come here to the font, and you're gonna type in I Love Glitter. You will have to type it download this font you can find it on the font.com i would try to leave it in the description box for you and it is 100 percent free for commercial use so boom we have that so now we're going to delete this one we don't need it anymore and now we're going to take this and we're going to put it right over in the middle of the word mom now i see a lot of people leave it just like this they just do two types of vinyl a black vinyl and then a color vinyl and they just layer it like this i think that doesn't look good in my personal opinion because sometimes it's hard to read the name so the knockout is perfect for this type of style because it'll be able you'll be able to see the names clearer and better so what we're going to do now we're going to click on the name sarah and elliot we're going to go over to the side and hit the star here this is called the offset panel. We're going to click that and then we're going to do offset here. And then you're going to do a size. I like to do mine at point one. And then 
I like to do the round version. There's a straight and the round. There's not too much of a difference depending on what you're doing. But I leave it at round. And you're going to hit apply. And you're also going to come here and you're going to change the color of it. And I do mine to yellow. Just because it's bright and I can really see it. Now what you're going to do is you're going to come and you're going to click the yellow only. And then you're going to hold the shift key on your keyboard and you're going to select the word mom too. So now we have both those layers selected. Now we're going to come over back to the side and we're going to hit this right here where it says modify panel. It has like a little rectangle in a circle and click that and then you're going to hit the subtract button. And as long as you have both layers selected, the yellow offset layer we just offset layer we just did and the word mom, it should work perfectly if it doesn't delete it, delete it. If it doesn't delete it, that means you do not have both layers selected. And there we go. And now we have a perfect offset. And you can make it as big as you want, as little as you want, as much, you know, blank space as you want, basically between the two words. But now you could take this and you could put it on HTV to put it on a shirt. People do that a lot for like Mother's Days and birthdays um, for their mothers or for people they know. You could put these on shirts. You could also put it on like a cup. You could put it on the glass tiles from like Home Depot or Lowe's. But it's a nice gift and a lot of moms like this. It's very, it means a lot to people to have custom things with their kids' names on them. Um, you can also do the keychains. I do keychains from Zindi. She has a mom keychain, and that's also very popular to put the names on that as well. But yeah, I hope this video was helpful. If you guys want to see more silhouette tutorials, please let me know. Um, if you like this video and thought it was helpful, please give me a thumbs up, and please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye now.